It's early in the morning, just like this, Bruce Santee, when I like to come sit out and listen to the birds chirp. Get a sense of your day, understand what uh, the coming hours are gonna bring by listening to them squawk and flutter about. You know, if you listen close enough, the birdies will tell you a story about anything you want to know. And all I keep hearing from them is about July 14th. Hollywood, Florida, the Hollywood heat wave, as it were. It's gonna be me, it's gonna be you. It's gonna be the Ring Warriors Grand Championship on the line. And six months ago, I don't think either one of us would've thought that'd be happening. But life has a funny way about throwing curveballs, doesn't it, Brucey? Because here we are, you sitting atop Ring Warriors wearing that big gold belt, and me chasing Cole Cabana for 10 pounds. It's not about Cabana, it's about you. It's about the birdies. Because they've been a chirping, Brucey. You know, they say you've got all the physical tools. You're a mammoth mountain of a man. Tough as nails. Strong will. Got a hell of a wrestling acumen. But the birdies also chirp a different tune about Bruce Santee. They say you don't have the heart. They say that you don't have the heart of a champion, Bruce Santee. The birdies, as they chirp around, say that Bruce Santee worries more about politics or the wrestling business. What people are saying more than what he should be doing. Now, I don't know if I agree with that. Take everything after 17 years in this industry with a grain of salt. But what I do know is that you're the one wearing the grand championship. What I do know, Bruce Santee, is that I'm gonna stand 18 feet across the ring from you. We will look eyes to eyes, nose to nose, and toes to toes. And I will find out whether or not these birdies that have been flying around talking about your heart are right or not. Be warned, I've had a very, very bad couple of months. And as a result, I've got a very, very bad attitude. And while there's a good chance I could come into Florida wearing 10 pounds of leather and gold again and call myself the world champion, if I don't, eh, the birdies, they're gonna be singing an entirely different song. <laughs>